Hey guys, so today I want to do a fitness haul and I'm gonna talk a little bit about my fitness journey that I've been going on. I'm not trying to turn this channel into like a whole fitness channel. I'm not here to give a lot of like health and fitness advice. I'm definitely not an ex expert, um, but I do communicate a lot of my fitness journey on Snapchat and Instagram and Twitter and I do get a lot of questions on how it's going and people see the workout gear that I'm using or they have questions about my fitness journey. So I thought it'd be fun to come on camera and do updates every now and then and to share haul videos with you guys because of course I'm shopping and show some of the new products that I've been doing and using for my health and fitness journey. So um, I have started really, really, really getting into health and fitness. I've been going to the gym very regularly since October, which may not sound like a long time for some people, but for me, that's so long. Um, I've never like regularly been active or fit like this in a very long time. And those of you who follow me on Snapchat where I'm definitely the most raw have seen the blood, the sweat and the tears. And yes, I said tears, there are tears. Um, I come on camera, you know, and I'm so happy and I'm so positive about it, but it really is so hard and I'm so hard on myself. And I know a lot of y'all are going through similar things or the same exact things as far as health and fitness go. And it's definitely a journey. Like it is a journey. Um, but I wanted to come on camera and hang out with you guys for a minute and show you guys some of the cool products that I've been using and some fun stuff that, um, makes the journey a little bit more fun. <laughs> so the first item that I want to share with y'all is a new book that I got. This is Big Fat Lies. This is by Kaylin Poland. She has a YouTube channel and I follow her on all social media. Like I follow her on every single platform. She's always popping up and helping to keep me motivated. And I adore her because I feel like she is so real. There are so many um, health and fitness kind of channels or uh, influencers these days and so many of them I don't feel like I can relate to at all because they're just a whole nother level of like health and fitness. Like they have these dream bodies that are just so impossible to me or they just they're so educated and they've been doing it for so long and for me Kaylin is just so natural and she's so real about everything she's very raw and i feel like what she's gone through is very similar to like what i go through so finding someone like that that you can relate to i think is really important but i love her book um and it's just like a nice simple book it has lots of helpful tips in here has lots of question and answers it has ways to reflect on yourself she talks about health and fitness in here and um it's called big fat lies because she kind of goes over a lot of things that people say like that you can't eat carbs and be healthy and like lots of things that i've heard said online and a lot of things that a lot of these really famous like influencers talk about that make me feel like it's impossible. And I know that that's stupid, but uh, some of these influencers, I just follow them and I'm like, there's no way, like I can't do that and I can't relate to that. And for some reason, Kaylin just speaks to me on a very like real level and I just adore her and I feel like, um, She's really cool. <laughs> um, it says how this, this is like her little truths that helped her lose 65 pounds without giving up pizza and ice cream, which I mean, obviously I can't give up pizza and ice cream. Like, hello. So I will uh, leave her information down below. I don't know her or anything. Like she has no idea who I am, but um, I love her. So if you guys are looking for someone to help motivate you, um, I will leave her information down below. The next new item that I got that I'm obsessed with is a new set of Bluetooth headphones. These are Skull Candies. I feel like Skull Candy's not cool anymore. Like when I was in high school, everyone used Skull Candies, and now I feel like everyone's on like Beats and I don't, I, I don't know. There's other expensive things that people use. <laughs> um, I'm obviously not very hip, but um, I got these at an outlet and I absolutely adore these. These are so fun. I think that Bluetooth speakers are super cool. I can actually put my uh, my phone in my locker at the gym and then I can control it from my headphones and I don't have like a wire on me. I don't have to worry about carrying stuff around. It's super convenient and I love it. Um, this is only like $30 for these, which I didn't know you could get Bluetooth headphones that worked really well for $30. So I was very impressed. Um, and I think these are awesome. The only thing is that they do, uh, make my battery die really fast on my phone. Like they suck the life out of my battery because I have to have my phone on Bluetooth and then I have like these hooked up which I have to remember to charge these because I've never had headphones I have to charge before because I always just have like a wire. But anyway, they are super cool and I think that Bluetooth speakers are 
or headphones are definitely convenient if you are a lifter. Um, I do, well, anything. I mean, even if you're doing cardio, it could be helpful, but like I notice it, especially when I'm lifting, that it's nice to have these. If y'all follow me on YouTube, then you know it's no surprise that I'm obsessed with shopping. There's so many hauls on this channel. It's a little ridiculous. Uh, but when it comes to health and fitness, I feel like it is really important to reward yourself. And for me personally, if I have cute workout clothes or if I have like good workout clothes that fit me well and work well for me, then it's going to be that much more motivating for me to go to the gym. So maybe that's an excuse but that's really how I feel. So I got new Nikes, uh, new shoes. I actually Snapchatted these already, um, but these are from Nike. Again, these are from the Nike outlet. I love the Nike outlet. I don't really know what the difference is between like real Nike and like the Nike outlet, but I always shop at the Nike outlet and I love all my stuff. So I don't know, there might be a difference because it is a Nike factory store, uh, but I love these. So um, these shoes are, the Nike, oh, Nike Free Run Fly Knits. I'll leave all the information down below if you guys are curious. But I got mine in black and white, and I am obsessed with these. Not only are these super, super cute, but they're so comfortable. These are like air, you guys. Like, I cannot feel these on my body. It's crazy. They make my feet like so lightweight and bouncy. Um, these are trainers, so the soles are like trainer soles. I love training shoes, they are my favorite. I do not like running shoes. Um, these are bomb. I had other Nikes that were black and white that I still like and love, um, but these are really nice because they're so comfortable and the fly knit is like, it's super flexible and it allows a lot of movement, especially in the toe area. And what's nice about these is that they're very narrow and tight and they're just so flexible. Like they're just, they're so good um, for lots of movement. If you do a lot of training, if you're doing any sort of, um, like I wore these for kickboxing the other day and they were perfect for that. Um, they're just really, really nice, super comfy. And I think they're really cute too, which is always a plus. I gotta have cute workout clothes. Also from Nike, I got super cute joggers. Um, I don't normally wear pants to the gym unless like I haven't shaved, <laughs> let's be real. Um, usually I wear shorts or um, like workout leggings, like uh, like tight leggings, but these are like actual sweatpants. These are joggers, they're super cute. Um, they're very, very thin and comfy and then they're like capri joggers like so um what i love about them is how thin the material is like they're honestly so thin but they're not hot so i can wear like comfy sweatpants without feeling like i'm wearing a blanket on my body which is of course important if i'm working out because it gets so hot um, but i wanted something like this so that would be comfortable and something that would be good for post-workout uh, i also think that this will be nice when like i said i haven't shaved and i don't want to shave and i need to go to the gym but i don't want to be hot so that's just really real. That's probably too real. You probably didn't want to know that. Next, I have some of my all-time favorite things from Nike ever. Um, I've got a big old Nike bag right here. Um, and these are their shorts. And these are running shorts. Now, there's so many different types of like workout clothes. Like I was talking about with shoes. There's so many different like types of shoes. But the running gear, as far as shorts go, are my absolute favorite. Um, I got these ones and I got them in every single color. <laughs> so these are cool. Um, they have like a little zipper on the back. So you can see that little zipper on the butt. It's super small. Like you're not gonna fit a ton of stuff in here. Maybe like a driver's license, but that's about it. I don't really ever use that. If I do, it's for like literally a driver's license or um, like my gym card or something. Um, but I really don't like use those. Anyway, um, so this is what the front looks like. They're just little short shorts. What I love about these is that they have the like built-in underwear if you will has like the little um it looks like panties is what it looks like it looks like a built-in panty that's attached to the running shorts and the men's running shorts are the same way they have like the little built-in like panty <laughs> guys probably don't like that term um but it's they're really comfortable for running you don't have to wear underwear if you don't want to which is always nice because you know then you can go longer without doing laundry um or comfort or whatever. I look at it as laundry, but that's probably not what normal people do. Um, but I just love these. They're so comfortable. They're short, but you don't have to worry about them uh, like moving around too much. They're short, but they have that built-in underwear, so you're not gonna be revealing anything. And they are very loose. Ugh, this is a bad description, but they're a little bit more on the loose side, so they're comfy and they move easily. So I got them in black. 
I got them in red. Oh, I love the red ones. They're so cute. Um, and they do have a drawstring on them as well. So if you need to adjust the waist, you can. I wear an extra small in these. Um, I do feel like they run a little big. So that's red. And then I also got, oh, I got blue. These are cute. Look how blue these are. Oh, that's so fun. And then I got the teal. The teal's really cute too. So cute. And then I got uh, like a darker blue. Cute, right? I love this color. And then I got, um, that's it. That's all, the, that's it. I say that like I only got like, that's it. Um, no, I got a lot of the shorts, but I got them in every color. And I like having colorful shorts because I usually wear like a basic top with colorful shorts and then like my black and white shoes. So it's all good. <laughs> um, I think those are super fun, super comfy. And I totally wear them to lounge as well. Like I wear them to bed. I wear them um, with like a t-shirt when I'm hanging out at home. Like they're just easy and they're comfortable and they're a great material. I highly recommend those shorts. And then these, um, I got this cute little top. I love Love this top um, this is one of the dry fit tops I believe this is for like running as well it's super see-through and it's like a really low um, T racer back kind of tank top um, I don't know what this is for I don't know if it's supposed to be a tube top I don't know but for some reason I'm a medium in it which is weird because I mean not like bad weird but I'm usually almost always an extra small but for some reason I'm a medium in this so maybe these I don't know I just like it. <laughs> I thought this would be cute with like a colorful sports bra underneath it. And yeah. So it's everything I got from Nike. From Nike, I really love their workout clothes and their shoes, um, specifically their shorts. Now when it comes to their like legging pants, those like the like tight running pants or um, like workout pants, I actually don't really like Nikes very much. I've had a couple pairs and they don't last me very long. I actually work through them. I end up tearing them at the seams. So they're not my favorite for those. But for the shorts, Definitely, and shoes, definitely. Um, so moving on to Victoria's Secret. Um, Victoria's Secret, obviously I love everything from this store. Um, I love Vicky's. <laughs> I maxed out a credit card in my younger days. I'm sure y'all have seen my huge Victoria's Secret haul. Um, I'll link that down below if you guys want to see it. I have like a massive Victoria's Secret haul, which was like one of my top viewed videos ever. Um, and yeah, I used to get in some serious trouble with that Vicky's credit card. Um, don't recommend that, but Okay, it happens. Um, my favorite thing from Victoria's Secret, their sportswear is so, so, so good. Their workout bras are bomb. Like, I love their sports bras. I honestly think they're so much better than like every other workout brand that I've done workout bras from. I've done sports bras from like literally everywhere. Like, I've done Under Armour, I've done Nike, I've done um, like, I've done all the Target ones, all the like brands. Honestly, I've done everything but Victoria's Secret is for sure my favorite and I think it's at the best price too. Like I had a few Under Armour bras for a while and they were so expensive and I just didn't even like them very much. Now I usually get like the really basic workout bras, sports bras, but this one I had to get because it's super cute. Um, so this one, I swear Jacqueline Hill was wearing this the other day. I saw her with like a caged sports bra and I was like, <gasps> is that the bra I just bought? Um, but it looks like this and it has like the caged on the front and then the back is this X. Now the back is super nice because these straps are really, really thick. So they give a lot of support and then they are adjustable. They do have this like big clip here that adjusts, which is very, very, very handy. Um, you really want sports bras that are gonna adjust, especially if you don't have like an average shaped body, I guess. I hate even like saying that term, but like if you're not someone who usually just like fits in like a general, fitting arrangement um, then you want their bras because they adjust really well um, and then this one has the removable pads in the front as well I usually keep the pads in but it's nice to have the option if you want to take them out and yeah this is what it looks like I think it's super cute I'm wearing one of the sports bras right now actually um, this is like their basic ones I wear these all the time this is the one that has no padding in it um, they're super basic they just have like the band down here and they're super like generic but i love these kinds of sports bras i have them in like every single shade from victoria's secret they go on sale for like 15 bucks if you have large breasts then they probably won't work as well for you i don't <laughs> um it's either a good problem or a bad problem but um 
they work really well for me. So if you don't have large breasts, then that's my suggestion. And then I got these super cute workout pants. Um, workout pants, like the legging workout pants from Victoria's Secret are another one of my favorites. They fit very, very well. They're very comfortable. I can wear them to work out and to like lounge around on a regular basis. For me, they work really well for lifting. Now, I've heard people say that they don't work well for lifting. I've heard people swear that they can't use anything except for um, like Lululemon for lifting. I'm not that high maintenance, I guess, but I think these are so dang cute. These are from the knockout line from Victoria's Secret Sport. Um, they are in this really cute color. This color is like a light gray, and these are high rise. I love the high rise ones. And then these are cool because they have like the motor, like bike stitching on them, and then they have the see through patches all the way down. So I'll stick my arm in here so you can see what I'm talking about. On the back of them, it has this like see-through sheer part right here. And then on the front, there's the see-through sheer stripes along them. I think these are so cute. They're so comfortable. And they were having a special when I bought the sports bra that if you buy a sports bra, you get the workout pants for 35 bucks, which is a really good deal because normally those sports pants are $69. So that's a good deal. I have a bunch of the workout pants. I've never gotten this exact one from Knockout before, but I really like them. They fit very well and I'm excited to use them. I will definitely post a picture on Snapchat if y'all wanna see. Next, I got some workout pieces from Calvin Klein and these Calvin Klein items are all from the Calvin Klein outlet as well. I'm a bargain shopper, what can I say? Um, these are from the Calvin Klein outlet and I have bought similar ones to these from TJ Maxx before actually. And I mean, a lot of places sell Calvin these days. I love their sports bras. Um, they're not, <sighs> okay. So, <laughs> um, the Victoria's Secret sports bras, like this one and like the more supported ones are much better for, um, being more active. If you are someone who needs more support or if you do a lot of cardio, then I don't recommend these Calvin ones at all. I actually had a comment in one of my last videos where I hauled these similar bras to the Calvin ones and they were saying like, oh, don't get those. I don't recommend those for working out at all. They're awful. I love them. Um, they work really well for me for lifting and for lounging because they're so comfortable. Um, I wouldn't do any like intense cardio in this. Definitely don't go try to run a mile in these. Um, at least that's my recommendation. But like I said, I'm a small girl. So I, you know, I don't have that problem. Um, but these are just like, they're super basic sports bras. I'm sure you've seen like the Jenner girls wearing these. Um, they're literally so sheer. Like this is, I don't know what this is made out of, but it's like, I mean, it's nothing. There's no padding in here at all whatsoever. Um, but they're so comfy. They're so soft. Um, they're like silky. I got them in black. I got them in this, uh, fuchsia color, which I think is really fun. And I got, oh, I got a bunch of them. I got this blue one here, which is really cute. It's like a aqua bright blue color. And then I got white. And the white one's a little different because my white one actually has a sheer back on it. And the white one has a different like band at the bottom, whereas these ones are like this silky band. I don't know what the difference is, but they feel different. Um, these, I got them in a medium. I should have got them in a small, but I got them before I lost weight. And then I lost a little bit of weight. Um, not that I lost a lot of weight. I'm trying to gain muscle. I'm not trying to lose weight. But when you're, you know, eating healthier and working out, of course, you lose like the fat on your body. And unfortunately, all my fat was in my boobs. So now I have no boobs. Not that I had a lot before, but now I have like no boobs. So I should have gotten a small but I got a medium and they're just really comfy. I love the way that they feel against the skin because they are so silky. Um, so they're the best like lounge bras. They're really, really nice for um, post-workout because after I work out, I'm like beat. I'm dead. I need like comfy clothes or I will just like fall over and die. So next I got two workout tops from Kohl's and Kohl's isn't a store that I find a lot of good stuff at. I feel like it's very hit and miss for me, but the good thing about Kohl's is that they do have so many coupons and you can stack their coupons and they always have a coupon. So I got a good deal on these. I think I paid like eight bucks a top or something and these are really cute. They're like, they're kind of more of like a manly muscle fit. Like you can see they have like the really big 
armhole here and then they have like the wider stance so they do have more of like a relaxed kind of like muscle tank it kind of looks like like a guy's tank top but it's women's um i got the gray one which is like a heather gray color with some dark gray charcoal detailing and then the back is that dark gray charcoal and then it has the little reflector on the back um i really like the way these fit they're very relaxed very comfy and i really liked the price so i also got it in black and I really like to have lots of like comfy workout clothes so that I can be like on my not confident days, I guess. Um, I don't have to worry about wearing like really tight structured things to the gym because I know most workout clothes like those pants that I showed y'all from Victoria's Secret, like most of my workout clothes are pretty tight, um, but I don't always feel the most confident in that. So having something that's cute but loose at the same time where I don't feel like I have to like show off every little bit is kind of nice sometimes so i really like these they're comfy and the price was great and then next i have a bunch of items from avia avia is a brand that i get from walmart i've also had a lot of it sent to me from their website which is super cool i have posted several pictures in their activewear because i love them i actually talked about their activewear in um a favorites video and even in like my last activewear haul and even in like a Christmas haul. So I do really love their stuff. I've been using it for a long time and they recently sent me a box of fun stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys my favorite pieces that I got sent and I'm also uh, would recommend you go to my Instagram and check out my pictures featuring Avia because I have some really cute pictures that have like the activewear on. So this is a sports bra and this is like a charcoal gray sports bra. These little sections here are see-through, like they're like a mesh see-through and then the back of them crisscrosses. I really like these sports bras. They're super comfortable. They have a lot of sizes and I love the AVIAs available at Walmart because honestly, it's important to have active wear that's affordable and that is accessible because I feel like not everyone can afford Lululemon. I can't afford Lululemon. Um, so <laughs> uh, Avia is a great alternative for me. Um, I wouldn't say they're like the best workout clothes that I've ever used, honestly. Um, a lot of my Victoria's Secret stuff I like a lot better. I'm sure Lululemon is better. Um, but I really, really do like these pieces. They're affordable and they're really, really cute. And it's something that is good for you if you are kind of fluctuating in weight as well. Because if you are losing a lot of weight or if you're like gaining a lot of weight for muscle, then you want active wear that you're not gonna have to spend like a bunch of money for a size and then you're gonna like change size in like a few months when you do make your goal weight or whatever. So um, I do like that about them. I also have a matching set here, which I think is super cute. When I first got it, I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to wear that. But now that I have it, I'm super into it. So the pants are this like really cool, like electric blue. Um, I've worn a lot of their pants on Snapchat and I've gotten so many questions on where they're from because I have a lot of really cute pairs from them. Um, but I get a lot of them from these guys. And these are like this like lightning kind of situation. And then they have those sheer zigzags all the way down that we were talking about earlier how it has like these sections here. You guys can't see this. There's like little stripes along here that are see-through all the way down the leg, which is really cute. And then the matching top is a little sports bra, which is like the same design. And then the back has these cute little cutouts down the back. Now, I am not the kind of girl who can wear a sports bra and pants and call it good. I always wear shirts to the gym, always. I have, I'm, Oh, I don't know if I will ever be confident enough to work out in just a sports bra. I definitely do not have the body for that. I'm definitely too insecure for that, um, but I'm working on it. I've been wearing a ton of the ABS socks lately. Um, they've got a bunch of different types and they honestly sent me so many and they're all super comfy. Um, this one is cushioned performance these ones are the, these ones are really nice these ones are like the thicker ones i really like these because i can like feel the like thickness in the sock when i'm wearing it with my shoes like i like the way that they fit and like the heel um these are really nice and they come in like tons of fun colors and these are the ladies cushioned performance socks from avia so i like those and then the ones i've been wearing a ton actually are these guys right here which are just like a basic sock like i can't really show you what they look like. These ones are very, very thin, but they're very comfortable. So if you're hot or if you're like working out and your feet get really hot, then these are nice. They're not like the best socks I've ever worn because they are so thin. Like you can like see my hand through that, but I have noticed that they're great when I normally my feet can get really hot sometimes. So if you are someone with hot feet, <laughs> then these are good.
These shorts are so cute. These are like the little runner shorts that I was talking about earlier. These are so cute. I love this like minty green and charcoal color combo. The biggest difference between these is that the like underlining in here isn't like a little panty. It's like a little spanky. It's like kind of shorts. So um, you can't see them when you're wearing them really. Um, but there is a little bit of a shorts down there, which is good if you are like super, super active and you're worried about like your shorts going up and showing off too much, then these will help you to not show off too much. But I love the color. They make you look super tan. All right, so that's it for all of the workout gear that I have to share with y'all, but I did get some new loungewear and like post-workout gear that I think is amazing, and I know you guys love wearing sweats. I mean, I like live in like loungewear. It's like the best, <laughs> and this company is a clothing company that specializes in some of the cutest and comfiest loungewear you will ever see in your life, and the brand is called ILY Couture or Illy Couture, and I recently showed y'all one of my favorite tops from them for my mom and that was in my Mother's Day gift guide. So I'll leave that in the description bar below if you guys wanna see that. But I got a few items for myself as well that I wanna show you guys. So these are their sweaters and they're just like a Henley kind of sweater with like the open top. There's no like hoodie to it. And these are so cozy. Like these are insanely comfortable and so cute. So this one is so so darling. This is one of my favorites. This one says less Monday, more Sunday. And I love the like graphic tee design of it. I think that the printing is so much fun. I love the font. I love the color. And it's honestly like the cuddliest, snuggliest thing in the whole world. Like I want a blanket made out of the sweater. And I think it's so cute. I love the way that this looks with everything. And every time I wear it, I get so many compliments. And honestly, I've just been living in it because it's so dang comfortable like I cannot express to you guys <laughs> how comfy these are and the inside of them has this like amazing like just um like softness <laughs> the interior is just so comfy and so cute and I love the way that these fit as well they're very flattering and while they're like a sweater material they're definitely like a sweater like a just like throw over kind of sweatshirt, they still give the body like a pretty form and a pretty fit and it's still flattering and you don't feel frumpy, you don't feel lazy, you don't feel ugly, you still feel like cute and you feel like comfortable and just like you're able to express yourself through a sweatshirt and it's so fun and I love it. So this one is one of my favorites, less Monday, more Sunday, which I mean, if you can't relate to that, I don't know how you found this channel. <laughs> The next one I got is super fun and I love the color of this one too. This one's more of like a darker, uh, like burgundy Merlot kind of color. And this one says wifey on it. Um, I am married. <laughs> I've been married for three years and I just think this is really cute. I love being a wife and I thought that this like font on here was super cute and it's just so like trendy and fun. And I like the color cause it's different. And again, it's the same shape, same style, exact same like sweatshirt. Everything about it is just as amazing as the last one, just a different design. And they have so many different styles, like so many different quotes, so many different like mom quotes, wife quotes, sister quotes, like so many cute like designs. So if you guys like loungewear, definitely check their site out. It's amazing. And then I got pants from them. And these pants, these pants you guys are like the comfiest sweatpants in my life. These are a charcoal gray color and they look like this. They are um, jogger sweatpants and the top has this cute little uh, tie on it, which I like because the waist is a little bit high on me. Um, I have short legs, I'm only five feet tall, so that's probably my fault, but um, I like having the option to tie the waists in because I do always feel like I need to adjust clothes differently because it's hard for me to find clothes that just like fit perfectly by themselves. So having clothes that adjust is important for my life. And I think that this like, color of lace is really cute with the charcoal and then it does have pockets which is nice because a lot of sweatpants don't actually have pockets it has front pockets that are like a great size like my phone fits in there like my headphones fit in there like everything fits in there and then the back pocket is this cute little like butt pocket which i don't use that's just cute but the front pockets are very practical so these are jogger styled sweatpants and that means they have like the little 
um, tight part at the ankle. I like these because again, I'm short, so it's easier for me to like adjust the length on my legs. I can like put it up higher, closer to my knee, or I can put it down closer to my ankle, and then I can wear whatever shoes I want with them. I think the joggers are, I mean, obviously they're trendy and they're cute, and I feel like everyone's wearing them, but I really like them because I feel like they're very practical. But these are just bomb because they're so comfy, and again, I feel like I'm wearing a blanket on my whole body when I wear this with the sweater. I just feel like I could like, conquer the world in comfort. It's amazing. <laughs> like I said, after like a really hard workout, after really, really pushing myself, I just want to like lounge around. I want to wear something comfortable and I want to just like let my body relax and then like wait for the soreness to kick in. So clothes like this are like the best for post-workout or just for being comfortable because I mean, who doesn't want to be comfortable? All right, well, that's it for this activewear haul. I hope y'all enjoyed. I'm planning on uh, progressively including a little bit more health and fitness into my channel, but only as you guys request it. I don't want to, like, do anything too overwhelming. This is a beauty channel. This will always be a beauty channel. My passion is definitely going to be makeup artistry for the rest of my life. I mean, I do makeup artistry as a job. I do it for a living, and that is what my channel is mostly going to be focused on. But I think it's fun to kind of share this journey with you guys and y'all have been asking on social media so I did want to incorporate it just a little bit but let me know in the comments down below what you guys do want to see if you do want to know more about the activewear that I enjoy if you like these kind of hauls or if you want more health and fitness tips and tricks that are very relatable because I am definitely not a professional in any way, shape, or form, then definitely let me know because I would love to give the people what they want to see. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all of your support, especially when it comes to health and fitness journey that I'm going through. It's really hard. It's so, so, so hard. And I feel like I am not the like ideal candidate for someone who would be doing health and fitness videos on YouTube. I mean, I'm not like a bodybuilder. I'm not strong. I'm not like, I'm not someone who was massive and I like lost a ton of weight or anything like that. Um, I'm just very normal. <laughs> I feel like I'm very, very, very normal. So hopefully um, you guys enjoy this regardless. I think this is a fun video to do and I enjoy hanging out with you guys and talking to y'all about my new activewear. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate y'all. Definitely check out my social media if you want to find me anywhere else. And I will leave all that details in the description box down below. See you guys later. Mwah.